that's built on a what they build that on is on lies. Mm. Some of the times I meet people when I'm like, sort of sit and talk to them, they're just like, well, "Not how I expected you to be." I said, "Well, in what sense?" Like, I expected you to be a lot rougher. Yeah, you expected <laughs> to be horrible. You? Yeah, kind of a bit actually. I did. Yeah, I was much younger. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we were also when we were younger. So, where where do you reckon this is all going? What do you think the end result of all this is? End result. Islamic dominance. Really? Where they take Well, us. I mean, the New Zealand Prime Minister has been enjoying her headscarf a lot recently, hasn't she? Mayor's well is fully converted. They're, 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 they're taking us down a path yeah. where they're removing all dissident voices, whether you like it or not, whether it be Alex Jones, whether it be yeah. me, whether it be Milo. The thing that I find unbelievable, I've committed no crime, I've broke no law, I've had no arrest, I've been removed from PayPal, from Twitter, from Facebook, from Instagram. There's now a campaign orchestrated and organised to have me removed from YouTube. I will be removed from society completely mm. for speaking openly and honestly about Islam and the effects it has on this country. That's it. If I'd incited, if I'd caused hatred, I'd have been arrested and tried for it. We have strict laws already that govern this country oh, yeah. that prohibit people from inciting violence or inciting hatred. So I clearly haven't done any, breached any of those laws. You can't take reality, truth, facts as hate speech in order to get your way of what you want and see a country the, the way you want it and then just silence all opposition to it. So unfortunately, I think that when people see we can't vote our way out of this because they're closing that down. As you've just said, UKIP shared something. It's been removed from Facebook. Um, look at the... I, I actually... So, yeah, we while recording this, we were just informed that someone was sharing a UKIP video in which we discussed Tommy, in fact. Facebook gave that person a three-day ban from the platform for sharing that, which... There we go. I just think that... It's, it's, it's worrying more than anything. The whole, the whole situation, when you look around... With Brexit, especially. Yeah. You're going to, at the end of censoring everyone, taking away their voices, telling everyone they're not allowed to say this, you can't do that, you're an extremist, you're a racist. Oh, and by the way, you don't have democracy. It's not good, is it? <laughs> it's not good. You know, it's, it's where's that going to go? I don't know how much you think the public will take. And somehow I'll be blamed. Thanks very much. Thank you. Good Cheers, luck. man.